Okay, so there hasn't been a video on the channel in a very long time, but there will be today. Uh, first, I want to say Happy New Year, Merry Christmas, because I missed all of that. Um, today, we're going to be taking a look at an RCA prison set. This is something that was uh, given to me by a friend. I need to fix this set for him uh, in order to receive this and a couple others. And I wanted this is because I've been wanting a clear TV for a while, and I can never seem to find these. Um, yeah, the CRT's got a little road rash on her. This was found on a pile of TVs in a uh, a parking lot somewhere in the projects of a nearby town. He's an urban explorer, the guy who gave this to me. So one of the reasons is because it's clear. The other reason is it's SDTV. It's got a digital tuner built in, and I don't have one of these, a small set, uh, with a digital tuner. So, that means it can receive over-the-air signals with just an antenna. This is what I mean by clear. And when I got this, you can see the water line. Um, it was full of ice from the water that had been in it. I took it all apart, let it dry for a couple days, and it fired up and worked. I be it not well, but it did work. The buttons were very, very finicky. So I went through, and it turns out every single button except the power button was bad. So I went through my stash, I found a whole bunch of buttons, replaced all those. Another thing this set does not have that I will be adding is a speaker. It has a full amp, you know, power amp, all that stuff. Just no speaker because it's a prison set. Um, what else? I added a power cord that was cut. There's the digital tuner. That's the digital tuner. There's your tube. There's the prison number. And it looks like somebody else's number on that was on there, but they scratched that out. Um, it works fairly well. In fact, the, the tuner in this, the digital tuner, is, is probably better than most converter boxes. I have a, a uh, antenna amplifier and whatever that's kind of antenna as I found hooked up to it. It works fairly well. Just no audio. Very bright, very strong CRT, very sharp, just road rash. So this has a, a, a very nice, WDKA is a very, very hard station to receive. The antenna is not pointed towards us. And see, you can adjust the volume. Why is that not going off the screen? So you can adjust the volume, it just doesn't do anything. So, and it's, I plugged a uh, speaker in, it does, it does do, it does work. So anyway, there's that, 49.2, charge, 49.3, TBD, these are all stations that you usually would not get. 49.4, stadium. 49.5, DABL, and then our close channel, 3.1, WSIL. 3.2 is uh, Heroes and Icons, which used to be Handy TV, but now it's Heroes and Icons. 3.3 uh, is TCN, True Crime Network. 3.4, Court TV. 3.5 is Ion, don't know what's on that channel. 27, now this is the uh, WTCT, this is a Christian channel. This is their HD, they were standard def and they just changed to HD. 
Uh, 27.2 is SBN. This is the Baptist Net, something Baptist Network. Notice how the S is just a 5 flipped upside down. Got some Jimmy Swagger. Those are still standard def. Um, I don't know what the Grio is. I've never heard of it. Laugh TV. I do know what this is. This plays a bunch of com comedy shows that no one's ever heard of from the 80s and 90s and early 2000s. Digi TV. I'd never heard of this either. I don't get this usually on a converter box. Stretched out. Oh, why? Bounce. I've never heard of this. Don't know what they play. And then we're back to 49, which is a hey, family feud. But this is a really hard station to grab. Very, very difficult station to grab. They were a pretty high power station, and then they, they severely reduced their signal strength. Now we'll go back. Actually, we care more about the, the, the retro station than that. But it all works. Um, got some digital breakup. This has got a, it's, it's got a really good tuner in it. And I'm gonna I'm gonna look for a tube, a, a, a CRT for it since this one's got so much road rash. I'll try to see what I can do about that. But um just kind of a, a show and tell video. I know nothing really has been going on on the channel. I do have things that that do pop up and prevent me from doing videos. Um, we should have some good repair resurrection videos coming out. Just hasn't been enough time really recently. What is this Brokeback Mountain? Get your prison on. Yep, so that's just something that I picked up or got given to me over the past few days. It's very cool. It's going to get used out here when I put a speaker in it because um, it's got a digital tuner and I can, I can watch TV out here without a converter box, which I don't have right now. But the other stuff that he dropped by for me to use his parts because I told him I needed some parts and he just threw some stuff in his car was this Magnavox which works somehow remote control Ooh, fancy it works the CRT is pretty tired I think it's from 88 and then He's a, one of those retro gaming guys, so he grabbed this for himself. It's a ViewSonic OptiQuest Q71, and we powered it up, and it was, high voltage was intermittent, and it was all over the place, and the horizontal frequency and stuff, stuff like that, so this one's going to get used for parts too from Chester, Illinois. So, ViewSonic. If anybody wants this, it's free before it gets raped or for its parts, its precious parts. So, yep. That's what's been going on recently here. Not a whole lot. The last video was about that RCA console. Jeez, that was a while back. It was about a month ago. But, yeah, as you can see, there's plenty of stuff to work on. No shortage of that. So, thanks for watching.